Good evening and welcome back to Let's Play Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of Liberty. When we left off last time, we were battling Vamp, and it wasn't going overly well, so I've got him down to about half hit points here. Let's see if we can't take this fella out. Oh, incredible. I didn't think that was going to work. Okay. He's not actually like really dead, is he? Colonel They've apparently completed the final check procedure for Arsenal Gear. Find Emma on the double. You've got to get her to install the virus program that the President gave you. When you find her, take her to the computer room on level B2 in the core of Shell 1. Shell 1? Oh, good grief. Snake, did you catch all that? I didn't make it on time. Arsenal's going active. Yeah, I heard. The hostage rescue's gonna have to wait. I'm going after Emma. We'll secure the computer room. Looks like we can't install the virus program without Emma. Can't your partner do it? I would if I could, but the security for this system is no joke. I need more time. That's why we need her. Understood. I'll make sure you have your family reunion. Uh, What's up? A lot of years have passed between E.E. E. and me. Then you should see her, right? I don't have the right to see her. Oh, we can talk then. about this later. <laughs> Raiden, I think you'd better get moving. Emma's in the locker room to the north, right? I'm on it. Snake's like, cut the emotional crap. Let's get to it. Okay, first this. Uh, we are gonna talk. Rose, I would like to save. What can I do for you, Jack? Well. Oh. 
am I in slot two? Not that it really matters, but you know. Sure. All right. Um, Jack, about trying to break into your room. Yeah, it wasn't Rose, a good idea, huh? Just forget about it. No, listen to me. I said I did it because I was worried about you, but it wasn't just that. What curiosity? I, I was suspicious. I thought there might be someone else. Someone else? Another woman. Rose. She's so insecure. I really thought so, because sometimes you're so horribly cold. You know I would. Why would you say I'm that to serious. him right now? Sometimes I feel like you're pushing me away. So I... Did you get in? Yeah. Are you satisfied now? There wasn't anyone there, was there? No. No, there was no one there. There was absolutely no one in your room. Not another woman, not me, not even you. Rose. I'm sorry. I just wanted to apologize, that's all. Talk to you later. It wasn't much of an apology. It's still riddled with accusations and angst. I seriously, Rose. Sometimes I feel you're so cold. Like you're trying to push me away. Then honestly, go away. The relationship is not making you happy. What is the point? Why are you struggling to stay with it? You know? You guys are miserable. Just... Oh. That would have been nice if I could have got that in the battle. Oh, well. Okay, I think that's actually the way I gotta go, right? Yeah, this is just the way that we came in. All right. Okay. Before we can worry so much about everything you're so concerned about, Rose, we gotta figure out how to take a woman who is afraid of the water swimming. I thought there was like an entrance or no, there's nowhere to go. Okay. So I just took a lot of damage for nothing. Oh good grief. Just get some air. Alright, down again. So Okay. Let's go all the way down. Shimmy along the bottom. This looks like we can get some more air here. Bunch of supplies I don't even actually need. Okay, well we're not gonna mess around with those little rooms anymore. Something wrong. Right. Right. That's a pretty effective noise when he dies in the water, though. It's got this horrible sort of this gutturalness. You're like, Bleh! yikes. Great the sound effect. All right, down we go. Do not go all the way straight across. Nope, 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 nope. Riding. We overshot it. Let's go here. There we are. Now then. Up for air. Down again. Hmm. 
all the way down. This looks like just supplies, but an easy one to get, so. Ooh, body armor. This is not a place to breathe. Alright. Down. Turn around. Up for some air. Body armor, huh? Excellent. Damage reduced by half. Okay, don't actually go that way. There, down, over, over. Got a hall right here. Let's go explore this. I think it has a high likelihood of being useful. Is this the door? Oh, there's a node. That's pretty fantastic. Excellent. All right. Are these all lockers? Yes, I'm going to try every single one. Ooh. Oh, is she hiding in the locker? Come out, come out, E. Way to make a first impression, Raiden. Jeez Louise. Oh, boy. <laughs> Are you alright? Just like her brother. Ryden, Jennifer I'm getting Hale. you out of here. Voice actress everywhere. Get me out! You're lying! Where are you taking me this time? What are you talking about? I'm here to help! Tell her about her brother. I'll prove it. Do you have nanos? What? Well, do you? I do. Everybody on this project has them. Okay, good. Let's try. Can you hear me now? Nano communication? That's right. I have nano machines too. Then you're not one of them. No, I'm That's not. That's what I've been trying to tell you. And you came to rescue me? Yep. Actually, I need your help to kind stop of. Arsenal. I understand you're the only one who might be able to do it. And who told you that? Your the brother. President. Really? I need well, you to the come with me to Shell One. Your brother's waiting for you there. My brother? Come on. We have to get moving. This place will be flooded soon. Since I'm checking the lockers, they can't swim. Well, leave me. You can swim. You used to love it. How do you know? Your brother told me. He's really here. Yeah. That's right. He's here to rescue you. I don't believe you. He would never come for me. And I'm telling you, he's here, waiting for us at Shell One. No, he left me, my mother, when we needed him the most. When my father died, all he could think about was himself. Emma, we can go over all that later. But first, we have to get out of here. No! I hate water! It's hopeless! I can't swim! Well, you gotta find a way, kiddo. Because you got a ton of water coming I can't at you. Swim. You can do it! I can't! Come on, deep down inside, you know you can swim. I can't keep my eyes open in the water. It's endless blue. The water, it, it wants me. It won't let me go. All right, then close your eyes. I'll guide you. I, I, I was injected with something. My legs. I have trouble moving them. Listen, Emma. Just hold your breath. I'll do the rest. Oh boy. All right. 
First we'll head to filter chamber two, then we'll take a break. And all I have to do is hold my breath. That's right. How long? Just a little while. Are you sure? Well... Of course I'm sure. That's how I got here. I, I don't think I can do it. I'm not good at holding my breath. Look, Emma, I have an idea. Put your ear against my chest and listen to my heartbeat. Your heartbeat? Count the beats. Don't think about anything else. When you reach 100, open your eyes. By that time, we'll be on the other side. Give me a signal if you think you're running out of breath. What will you do then? I'll swim faster. She's gonna have like a huge crush on us, isn't she? Tight. The hero who comes in to save her. No, don't. I I want to look in the the lockers. Okay, let's go. I'm closing my eyes. Take some deep breaths. One, two, three. Wait. <laughs> what is it? Uh, let me take off my glasses. You know, you should wear contacts. There's nothing Fine. wrong with my eyes. Hmm. Huh? My. I wear them for show. What? What? Trying to be different from the other girls? No, it's not like that. I like glasses. Oh, because her brother wears this them? This guy I liked who used to wear them. Your first boyfriend? No, her brother, right? No. Somebody more important. Anyway, they bring me luck. I see. Okay, let's go. Okay, can I go up? I'm wasting precious time, I know. Alright, you just wait here a minute. What? Raiden, go with Emma to Strut L. I will. If you exit the Shell 2 core and head south on the KL connecting bridge, you'll get to Strut L. There's no time. Move it! Press down and hold the action button near Emma to hold her hand. Start moving with the button pressed down and you can lead her by the hand. Push the action button again to let go. Alright, well you just hang out. Oh, come on, let me in. Really? Dang it. Fine. Oh! <gasps> I did not mean to do that. I'm so sorry, Emma. That was, oh, that was terrible. Okay, um, there we go. Okay, let's go in the water. Hey, shoot. I let go of the action button. Alright, here we go. Just punched a teenage girl. I feel horrible. She's scared out of her mind. Terrorists are attacking. It's like a terrifying day for her. And her newfound hero just comes right up and smacks her a good one. Accident, Emma. Accident. Okay, um, this way, I think? Oh, yeah, that went pretty well. Oh, I do still have my radar. I can pay attention to that. There, you did it. First leg of the journey. Good job. Alright, let's hold hands. Oh, where's this going? Oops! Okay, good, she's still there. You okay, Ryden? You did good. I concentrated on your heartbeat. It reminded me of when I was a kid. Swimming with your dad?
I remember my brother giving oh. me a piggyback ride. I was sleeping with my ear against his back. I could hear his heartbeat. Sounds like you were close. We were. Back then. We were stepchildren in our parents' second marriages. Wherever my brother went, I used to tag along. My brother didn't have any close friends, so he used to take care of me. We both wanted to be loved so much. So much that we used to pretend. Pretend? Yeah, we used to play house. My brother was the husband and I was the wife. But it was always just make-believe. We were only kids. Well, yeah, you were like six when he left, right? Family, but I think I know what you mean. Raiden, what's your status? We're working Colonel, on it. I've got Emma Emmerich here. We've managed to avoid drowning. Good job. Get her over to Shell 1 as soon as you can. That's going to be hard with the connecting bridge on the upper level destroyed. Didn't Olga say something about taking the oil fence at the bottom of Strut L? Yeah, but we need yeah, a level 5 keycard, I think. You should be able to go down by way of Strut L. Try and get over there. What about Emma? She's been injected with something and she can't walk without any help. Take her with you. Free your hands of any equipment and hold down the action button to give her a hand. To release your grip on her, take your finger off the action button. Emma can sit and wait until you help her back up. And be careful. You won't be able to use any weapons while you're leading her. Now head for Strut L. We're on our way. Raiden, we've infiltrated the computer room. What's your situation? Emma's safe. We're heading your way. <sighs> Good job. Shell One's deserted. Looks like everybody's aboard Arsenal. Well, that's nice. I had a look at the system, but there's nothing I can do. EE's our only hope. Right. I'll put her on then. Huh? EE? What? Nano machine. I'll use my codec as a relay. Uh. <clears throat> Here she is. Uh, how? Uh. EE, is that you? How? EE. Um. Why are you involved with Metal Gear? Huh? You knew our family's dark history and still got involved? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? I should have known. Answer me. Don't you owe her a sorry for mistake? abandoning her? I, I wanted Way to, to make hurt assumptions. You. I wanted to see you suffer. E -E? You abandoned me. No, that's not what happened. All right, that's enough. <sighs> Who are you? <laughs> I'm a friend of Otacon's, Emma. Otacon? Enough with the sibling rivalry. That's not what this is. We haven't got time for this. Raiden, get her over here right now. I... I... Gotcha, Snake. I'll head over there with Emma. Most of the enemies aboard Arsenal, but I suggest you be careful. Will Make do. Make sure Emma gets here in one piece. Raiden, take care of my sister. Don't worry. I'll get her there. I love how Snake has no patience for any kind of drama stuff. We don't have time for this right now. He's right, we really don't. Um, but I do like this whole little sister angle, and there's the, the distance between her and Otacon, and I'm hoping they work things out. It seems mostly like a misunderstanding, like just the way he processed his grief when the dad died is he left her and her mom, which really sucks, but you know, it's like he just suffered a blow too, so can't necessarily hold that against him. People process grief in different ways. So obviously it feels like abandonment to her, but it seems like they do, you know, generally care about each other and they could work through it. Now the plus side about going through the water EE -E, is it does mean that, you know, when you peed yourself when I terrified you with a freaking gun in your face, I can't believe we did that, um, but that should have washed off, so that's a plus. I'm kind of scared that Vamp is gonna like pop up in this room. It seems like something he would do. Well, that was certainly something, and that's the wrong button. Yeah? Be careful! Claymore mines are set there. Yeah, you think? I should have checked. I should have just stopped and looked at the phone before walking. Okay. Okay, so to find the mines. Which one? There we go. Just hang out there for a second, E. Clear a path. Okay. Oh, 
I'm kind of interested to see what Rose's reaction to her is going to be. Is she going to be jealous? She's jealous about everything else. Alright, here we go again. Emma, Snake and Hal are waiting for us in Shell One's computer room. I've got this disc that the President gave me. This disc is supposed to contain a virus that can corrupt Arsenal Gear's operating system. We need you to... This is... This is my program. What? Why did the President give it to you? Uh -huh. Did something happen to the President? Yeah. Dead. What? You actually wrote this virus? It's not really a virus. It's more like a worm cluster. It's actually a delayed effect autonomous program that's designed to invade GW's cerebrum and render its nerve connections useless. You know what GW is? Of course. I created it. Hmm. Huh? You look surprised. Uh, well... Cat got your tongue? I'm sorry. I... How about the Patriots? Ever heard of them? Yes, but I only know what I've been told. Man, she is in the know. Can you tell me what you know? Um, sure, but it's hard to put into words. Right. Are you reading me, Emma? Yes, loud and clear. The President said that Arsenal Gear was the Patriots' key to supremacy. That's as good a description as any. What exactly is it? It's a massive data processing system capable of controlling information on a global scale. Ah, a data processing system? That's right. The system's a social device for maintaining the Patriot's control. You've lost me. Well, in this day and age, information emerges from every direction and is freely distributed. A variety of information gathered by servers employing the latest in high-speed communication networks and P2P technology is rapidly circulated to individuals. In fact, the speed of this circulation process is accelerating on an almost daily basis. So they want to control all the information Patriots flow. They seem to be afraid of this development. Apparently, they believe that their role will shift from dominant to dominated. Huh? But let me give you an example. You're aware of Solid Snake's anti-Metal Gear activities, aren't you? Yeah, I know a little about it. Well, that's just a small sample of uncontrolled information. I can guarantee you the Patriots did not want Solid Snake's name publicized. Now, look at it like this. Political scandal, corporate corruption, up until now, the Patriots have managed to keep a lid on these and other self-serving events. But with their existing data processing system, they're no longer able to effectively control the flow of information generated at the individual level. Mm -hmm. With the newly created system, they can fully regulate digital information. High-level information can be categorized in stages, given clearance levels, and deleted as necessary, never to be seen by the public. By deleting such information, the Patriots can shape the course of history as they see fit. Somebody's bound to catch on. No, the memory capacity, not to mention the lifespan of the average individual, is extremely limited. On the other hand, digital information lasts virtually forever. It doesn't deteriorate. So? The alphabet. 26 letters, right? It could have been 30 letters. What if the four deleted letters were controlled by a program? Impossible. It's not. In fact, something similar is already underway. Do you know how many genes exist in an individual? About 30 to 40,000? Right. That's what was announced at the turn of the century. But there's actually 100,000 according to the original theory advanced by the scientific community. Information regarding the remaining 60,000 was suppressed by the Patriots. No. Why? How would you know? Do you know what a gene looks like? Did you count them yourself? There are research organizations. Those are interesting questions. Of course. And their reports have already been subtly altered. They're even beginning to believe the doctored reports. GW is a system that allows the Patriots to decide what will be recorded in tomorrow's history. So what we're talking about is one huge censorship system for deleting information which might be inconvenient to the Patriots. Exactly. The actual physical core for handling the task, GW, is installed in Arsenal. It's the only system in the world with an optic neural AI that has a parallel processing capacity of 980 trillion hammets. I suppose that being a specialist in neural AI and complex logic played a significant role in your association with the Metal Gear project. That's not the only reason. What do you mean? <sighs> I guess there are plenty of other reasons. 
Yes, there are. I understand. Do you? So Arsenal gear was actually designed to protect the GW system, wasn't it? That makes sense. Um, yes. It's armed with everything, including nuclear weapons, and is fully equipped with cyber-terrorist countermeasures. Physically and logically, it's the ultimate fortress for housing GW. But is the AI actually capable of controlling everything? No. GW is only the system's core. It's only for deciding what data is stored or deleted. The actual subsystem for executing the task exists within our social structure. What? Do you remember the panic that gripped the computer industry prior to the end of the century? Uh-huh, I'm old you enough to remember that. Problem? That's right. If you recall, our government supplied the world with a countermeasure program, using the internet at full capacity. The program was distributed to every governmental organization, every key facility throughout the world. In addition, the same program was included in an OS application for distribution among the public. Let me guess. The Y2K countermeasure contained a program designed by the Patriots. Yes, and everything supplied from that day onward contains the same program. Impossible. Do you know how a computer operates? Do you really know the basic principles on how data is exchanged? Uh... Nobody's aware of it, but there's a subsystem in place, and it's about to be activated. Is that why Solidus wants to burn out every electrical circuit in Manhattan with a nuclear blast? Probably, but the overall system isn't actually complete. What? It still lacks the necessary factors for judging situations. I heard they were planning a major experiment in the next few days to provide complex data for GW to study. And suddenly all this happens. And it's this! Emma, it's not your fault. If it wasn't for the terrorists... Yeah, you're right. Well, I think that's about all I know. Right. Uh, thanks. I think we'd better head for the computer room. <sighs> My bird in the computer room! Is he safe? Yes, he's safe. <laughs> that's your bird, huh? Is he overgrown parakeet? Excuse me, he's a parrot. And he's my best friend. My only friend. Well, the bird's okay. Good. Did you know that in the old days, miners used to take a canary into the mine shafts to detect toxic gas? Yep. I did know that. No. <laughs> I really needed someone to talk to. Right. I think we'd better get moving. We've got a little longer to cover than the last time. Oh, yeah, Let's this mess. Back. Whatever you do, don't open your eyes. Why not? A dead body, not a pretty sight. Oh. Once we get past it, it'll be too dark to see anything. What are those sticks in your head? These? They're just they're hair sticks. They're sticks. Yeah. They hold your hair in place. Did you know that they're pretty popular in Europe and South America? Can't say that I do. You're not only cute. But smart, too. Oh, I'm much more than cute. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Alright, I want to know what Rose has to say about all this. But I also want to... So it needed... It, it doesn't have enough data, so they're going to do a big experiment. To get it, the data. This is that's what this is, isn't it? This whole thing is a big setup to run this experiment. Cause and Campbell's in on it, cause he keeps talking about. He he mentions like the simulation and Snake wasn't in the simulation. Just ignore him and blah 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 blah. Like I don't know. I'm I could be wrong. I could be totally wrong. But that's my guess that he's in on it, and this is all just a big experiment designed to give Arsenal the information that it needs. All right. Uh, I'd like to save. Also curious if you have anything to say about EE -E here. Well, Jack, it sounds like you and Miss Emma are getting along just fine. She's so jealous. Rose? I've been monitoring your every move in conversation. I can't say it's been fun. Give me a break. I I'm only trying to keep her spirits up. Is that right? Absolutely. My mission is to get her to the computer room. That's all? Yeah. You're lying. You're attracted to her, aren't you? Rose. Admit she's cute. Cuter than me? Oh my Rose, gosh. you're beautiful. You know how I feel about you. Have you remembered yet? You mean April 30th? Yes, 
It's your birthday, isn't it? Wrong. You're not even warm. What is it then? Forget it. It's nothing. Maybe I'm just a little, a little jealous. A lot jealous. Rose. You'd better get moving. Good luck. Rose, I, I feel sorry for you as a character, Rose, because I, I can't help but dislike you. With all this jealousy, all this insecurity, all this nagging at him while he's on a mission to stop terrorists. I, ugh. Okay, so, let's see. Oh, this is the way I want to go. Down we go. Alright. Down. Oh, I'm watching it. We need to go faster. Okay, so through here. This room I kind of suck at. I'm a bit concerned about this. I think we're going to have to come up for air at some point. Come on. Up, up, up. Get the air. Oh, hey. Well, well. Okay. All right. Oh, come on. Almost there. Again. Okay, we got it. Ah, we gotta breathe. <laughs> okay. Try that again. Oh, she really needs to breathe. Okay. <gasps> Sorry, Emma! Oh no! Emma, open your eyes. Emma! Emma! Oh, well, let's try that again. Okay, down, 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 down. Die, Emma. I'm trying to go quick. Up, 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 up. <laughs> okay. So. Die, don't die, don't die. We're so close. Ooh. Well, that was a little nerve wracking, but we did it. Okay, so now where do we go? Yeah. <laughs> All right. Bugs. 
It's okay. Just, oh, come on. Hmm. I don't remember how to get rid of bugs. Well, let's go ahead, actually, and wind the episode down here. Please like and subscribe if you've enjoyed this. Come back in next time. We will find a way to get EE -E past all the bugs that she's freaking out about. And get her over to a tense reunion, I'm assuming, with her brother.